Ladies and gentlemen, we had an amazing week in the stock market. Some of my stocks are up 20%, other stocks are up 30%. So we're gonna be taking a look at those. And then I'm also gonna be sharing what stocks I'm looking to buy next. So let's get into it. First of all, if you guys are brand new to the channel, I do wanna say welcome, that's the first thing. But also if you guys are brand new in this channel, I like to post videos on personal finance, investing, stocks, uh, Tesla related videos. So if you guys are into any of that, then definitely leave a like and then maybe subscribe. It's up to you, but it wouldn't be a bad idea. Also, one more thing, I actually did a collab with Rumi's Life and she's another college student. She's 20 years old and she actually just purchased her first property, her first rental property, a couple months ago, I believe. And she actually posted a video on it. So definitely go watch the video, subscribe to her because she's doing amazing. And uh, Rumi, if you are watching this, I do want to say congratulations on the purchase. All right, so let me just explain the situation briefly. So I woke up on Monday, you know, it was a very average Monday. I woke up to my alarm clock, my loved one in my hand. Uh, and of course I'm talking about my phone. So I woke up and I started looking at, you know, several platforms. Uh, the first thing that I looked at was my YouTube, uh, my YouTube studio account, just to see how my channel performed overnight. There was really no change. So after that, I moved on to the second one, which was Weeble. I always check my Weeble account in the mornings just to see where the market is, where it's gonna go, or in my opinion. But I looked at my Weeble account and guess what? It was up $3,500, which is insane. Now, I didn't really think too much of it because I thought it was a glitch personally. Uh, you know, it happened before, so I didn't want to get my hopes up. I think I went back to sleep like for 10 minutes. And then after that, I woke up again and I started reading some articles. I started watching videos and I saw that Pfizer came up with a vaccine that was 90% effective. And that's when it set in. I was like, I'm up $3,500, which is insane. And at that moment, I sold all of my shares of Tesla. I sold all of my shares of Nordstrom and I sold most of my shares of CCL. Why you may ask? Well, it's because I was up a really significant amount. I mean, imagine waking up to this. <laughs> Sorry, I, I mean, I mean this. Yeah, I was not gonna let that pass up. So anyways, I sold all of those positions uh, and I actually did keep some CCL just because if it did go up another dollar, I wanted to make sure that I had some skin in the game, but I did wanna secure those profits, you know, in case it did go down. Now, after Monday, it did go down significantly. I believe it was like 22%, which is it, it, insane. But I mean, it, it shouldn't be surprising because it's happened in the past uh, two times to be exact. I've seen it rise, you know, 40%, 50% in a day, but then, or a couple of days, but then it just drops significantly over the next, you know, period of days. But then on Thursday, I actually saw CCL again and I saw there was a nice entry point again because of the historicals of CCL. I saw that once it drops significantly, it actually recovers uh, 7 to 14 percent. Now, I thought this was going to happen again to CCL and I actually entered Thursday pre-market with a pretty nice position too. I think I put in like $18,000. So I put in $18,000, bought 1,200 shares. I bought it at 2 in the morning. Uh, I went to sleep, I woke up, $600 profit. Boom, there we go, another $600. But just to summarize the first part of the video, I double dipped into CCL, made around $3,000, and I also sold CC, uh, not CCL, I also sold Tesla and Nordstrom, uh, made like $400-ish dollars. Uh, again, I'm gonna put the numbers on the screen, but it was a pretty successful week and that was only on my Webull account. It's not even including my Robinhood account where I also held some CCO and Macy's shares. Uh, I sold those too. I'm not gonna get into detail in those accounts, but if you guys wanna see a video on all of my accounts, I have four, definitely leave a like. And if we get 15 likes, I'm gonna make a video on it. I'm gonna make how much all of those accounts are worth uh, and also leave a comment. Just leave a comment saying that you wanna see that video and then I'll do it, why not? And with that information said, I know some of you guys are gonna be asking yourself or asking me rather, what stock are you gonna get into next? And that is a great question. And the truthful answer is I really don't know. It depends on the pre-market movement. If it goes down significantly, maybe I'll add in, uh, not add in, I'll have to buy some positions because I don't have any positions in my Webull account. There's only two stocks that are catching my eye right now. The first one is Neo, and then the second stock that I'm looking at is Peloton. Now Peloton hasn't recovered yet, so I am looking for that reversal sign. And if it does start to reverse, I'm gonna add a pretty good amount on that too. Uh, but again, they're on my watch list for now. Uh, it's not 100% confirmed, and I'm just looking at those stocks for now. So I guess this is a good time to plug my Discord group. If you guys are curious when I buy a stock, when I sell, how much profit, how much of a loss I make, definitely join. It's gonna be the second link in the description. And again, you know, I am not just gonna buy $5,000 worth of a stock. I like to take heavy positions. I like to put in $10,000, $15,000, $20,000, and then ride the recovery stage and uh, sell for 3%, 4%. It's a case-by-case -case basis, but uh, that's typically what I do. But again, 
again, if you guys are curious, join the Discord group and uh, it's gonna be free. So there's no charge. All I want in exchange for making the Discord group free is for you guys to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. And then also use my Weebo referral code. It's gonna be the third link in the description where if you guys deposit $100, you guys can get up to two stocks valued from $8 all the way to $1,600. Again, if, if you deposit $100. You guys can thank me later. But with that said, I think that pretty much sums up the video. If you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, let me know in the comment section. Did you buy any stocks, any recovery stocks such as CCL? Did you buy any airline stocks? Did you buy any Nordstrom? Let me know how the market treated you in the comment section. But again, with that said, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and see you guys in the next video. Peace out.